oh, um, do we have a warm up that develops balance and agility as well as timing between players? Warm up 31 is perfect here and combines four stations that interchange with each other, forcing players to consider timing and communication between groups. We begin with player one dribbling between poles or cones before stopping the ball in the center. At the same time, on the right side, we have a player jumping single leg through the hoops, timing their run so they are able to collect the ball that player one leaves for them. In station, three at the bottom, our player dribbles through the cone side to side and lays the ball off to player one, who takes it in their stride to the end of station three. At the same time, our initial dribbler will move across to station two to work through the hoops. In our final area, we have player four, who performs side to side steps with quick feet, awaiting a pass from player two across the grid. Once received, they must take a touch and drive back to the beginning of the sequence. Yes, this works. Can we move forward at all? Sure, we can maybe change the combinations between players. So, at the bottom at station 2, we could bring in some headers and volleys. Whilst on the left side, we could add a 1-2 combination for players. Be creative, but maintain realism in your progression choices. Get players to maintain accuracy and high standards when bringing in chest, headers and volleys, with accurate throws to support players. This will work great with almost any session. Thanks for this, we'll let you know how this one goes.